Thank you, Lisa. Switching from college to the NFL, it's been more than two months since pro football player Nate Allen was arrested and falsely accused of exposing himself to a 16-year-old girl. Cleared of any wrongdoing, Allen is still waiting for the results of an internal investigation promised by the Fort Myers Police Department. After two months of waiting, Councilman Tom Leonardo is defending the police chief and his tactics, while Allen's attorney says this is an insult to justice. February 16th, Nate Allen was arrested and falsely accused of indecent exposure. Evidence brought forth by his attorney, Sawyer Smith, made it clear Allen could not have been connected to the crime. Soon after, Allen held a press conference saying he wants answers, wanting to make sure other people aren't falsely arrested. The police department initiated an internal investigation, but after two months, Councilman Tom Leonardo says he wants the public to understand the reasons for it taking so long. I think they have been slow, and I think one of the reasons might be two officers apparently that are part of the investigation have been out on, on sick leave, and you can't interview officers that are out on sick leave when they're not there. So that's, I think that's been part of the delay. Allen's attorney, Sawyer Smith, is not pleased with that explanation for why the internal investigation is taking so long to complete. The only thing sick is Chief Baker's treatment of civil rights. As an experienced defense attorney, Smith believes the sick leave excuse just doesn't hold water and considers it an insult to the entire community. There exists no reason for the delay and the lack of investigation that we have seen thus far into this case. And because of that, Mr. Allen, through my law firm, will be seeking every means possible under the law to see that justice is done. Okay, well, the Fort Myers City Council will hold its meeting tomorrow at 4.30 to discuss the issue. Now, we want to hear from you. Do you think FMPD has been dragging its feet with the Nate Allen investigation? Is two months more than enough to get the job done? Give us your thoughts when you call us at 239-206-FOX4 or email us at news at fox4now.com.